প্রথম যিনি থাকছেন এবং তিনি হচ্ছেন ভিনসেন্ট ওয়া আমি তাকে ইনভাইট করব আমাদের মঞ্চে আসার জন্য এবং আশা করছি যে আপনারা ডেফিনেটলি পুরো দিনটা আমাদের সাথে থাকবেন এবং এনজয় করবেন থ্যাংক ইউ ভেরি মাছ Thank you very much. Very good morning to one and all and to those who are also attending this meeting here live stream. Firstly, I want to welcome you to this event. We are very excited to have you attending this event. Uh, I'm personally very excited to be here because this is my first time in Dhaka and in Bangladesh. So, I'm learning a lot about your city and your country. and also learning a lot from you. I want to make a special recognition before I actually start my address by acknowledging those women who are here with us and uh, on the live feed. We don't have a lot of uh, women developers and IT professionals. We need more of you. And so we want to thank you for uh, making IT as your career and your profession, and we want to thank you for that. Let's give them a round of applause. So I'm here this morning. My name is Vincent Kwa. I'm here to give you the address, uh, and therefore you don't see any slides from me. Uh, very often you don't get to attend a talk by a Microsoft person and don't see slides. So I want to make sure that there are opportunities for you to experience that. A little bit about myself. Um, I come from Singapore. I've been working for Microsoft for the last eight years. My role is the developer uh, platform evangelist for academic for Asia Pacific. And that is 12 countries under my uh, management in charge. I'm also the lead for Uh, the new markets. New markets would mean countries like Brunei, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, uh, as well as Cambodia, Nepal, Laos. So I do have a fairly wide range of portfolio and I do spend my time traveling, learning and observing the kind of work that IT professionals do in their respective countries. This morning you are attending a Microsoft event, uh, a, a .NET open day event, but with a slight spin. It is an open source in .NET. So that's an interesting part uh, of the title, and I hope it captures your attention. <coughs> Windows is a unique opportunity for everybody. It is the largest technology platform in the world today with more than 1 billion devices, whether it's PCs, notebooks, and servers, that is running Windows. No other technology platform has such size and impact on our world today. It is the broadest platform that is available to you because it has presented with many, many people and companies the broadest business opportunities. It has the widest range of available tools and technologies. And many companies have built them on top of the Windows platform. Windows has also given you some of the world's most successful technological companies. both software as well as solution companies. And so, as you can see, Windows is one of the biggest technological impact in our lifetime. Microsoft as a company has been working in the open source environment for the last 10 years or so. This is an open, uh, this is a practice that we have adopted 
an open source practice, meaning we're trying to understand how people can be enabled and empowered through technology. We have invested in interoperability laboratories in our own company and in our own facilities. We have collaborated with governments and companies to understand how different technologies can interoperate with one another. There are a lot of uh, projects that have been developed and made available to the community, like yourself, through some of the efforts that Microsoft has done. For example, CodePlex. That is a place where you can go and try to see what is available, the kind of products and technology that people have developed or people have tried and to see what can be done in an open source fashion. Microsoft as a company sees ourselves as a platform provider and an enabler. Therefore, standards are very important to us. And we are working very, very hard to ensure that we work with the different standard bodies that we are collaborating with. Intellectual property is something that is very critical to us because it is a very important part of our business model. There are some parts of the technology that, you know, not just Microsoft, but many other software companies have used as a key driver for our business model. But we also recognize that as a company, there are also aspects of technology that we can make available openly and freely to community and to users. And so, our work with open source is ongoing and important for us. I think some of the recent efforts that we have done in this area includes our commitment to HTML5. That is a huge commitment by the company. And we want to make sure that when we adopt HTML5 as a standard, it is really truly a standard across the different platform. Of course, it has to be made available on the Windows platform as the best way to approach it. Standards, while it's important, implementation of the standards can be different. But this is where different companies will use different approaches to implement those standards to the best of their abilities and to make sure that it works the best on our own platform as well. So, what is the conclusion of all this? To me, it's very simple, not that because I work for a company, Microsoft, but when I look at technology as a landscape and as a strategy to take us into the future, I see Windows as a platform that has a long history of successes and it's a platform that you can trust. I see Windows as a platform that you can rely on because you have hundreds of thousands if not millions of businesses that has built their own successes on the Windows platform. I see Windows as a platform in which you can grow your business. But that also means that you need to understand what your business model is. And I see Windows as a platform that definitely you can develop your solutions on. It is a platform that is here to stay. It is a platform that will be here in the next many years to come. I'm very excited about the future of Windows. I'm very excited about the future in which the technology can provide us and how it can actually help drive business for you and for us. So as I said at the beginning, I want to make the address short because the real heroes of this platform are the ones who are coming after me, who will show you what they have done, who will demonstrate the solutions that they have built and developed. So I want to wish everybody a 
success in this conference. I wish you had a very fruitful time, not just learning about the technology, learning about the different solutions that's available out there, but also to understand how this technology can actually propel your careers. So with that, I want to thank you, and I wish you all the best for the day. Thank you. And it's a really inspiring speech, I must admit, and uh, everyone will agree with me as well. So uh, right now we also have Mr. Tanzim Sakim. Uh, he will be presenting us uh, a topic one project showcase. So uh, we will welcome him. So uh, let's uh, put our hands together for Mr. Tanzim Sakim. मध्य न फ्रेंडलिंग मनोजेक्ट्रोल मान खुबी बेस्ट ऑफ बोथ वर्ड्स यूज कोई जेटा पीएसपी जेकने जेटा भालो करे से ऑफ कोर्स वो वर्ड पे सामने किस वाले भालो कास्ट करे से वाले उत्तर तो भालो सुंदर एक प्लेटफॉर्म से जो नाम रहा वही बेस्ट चीज़ था वही वर्ड थे कि यूज कोई आर वाले बेस्ट चीज़ जो सेट डेवलपमेंट डॉट नेट इटे यूज 